Hi, I'm Corey Mojo. I'm Dina Vies. My name is Doug Spear. I'm Brian Lawler. I'm Ken Macro. I'm Monica Reyes. I'm Lindy Singh. I'm a lecturer in the Graphic Communication Department. And, and I'm, I'm proud, proud to, to be, be in the Graphic, graphic Communication, communication family. family. So what is GRC? Um, graphic Communication is definitely difficult to define in a quick statement. Graphic communication is an exciting field that continually evolves into new things. Graphic communication describes everything uh, from print to electronic media uh, to all the visual aids that we provide. For me, graphic communication is about expressing myself visually and how do I do that? That can be through print, that can be through web development, that could be through app development, it could be through taking a banner and flying it behind an airplane. Every single class we have a lab where we come in and we actually like get to be hands-on and, and do print, do design, do um, packaging, specialty printing, whatever it is. We've got five or six, six student organizations that do international competitions where they're given a prompt to have to develop a product, they're, they're required to, to print that product. Every class we teach, with the exception of GRC 101, is a hands-on class. So when you take bindery, you learn how to do binding and finishing operations. When you take sheet-fed printing, you learn how to run the printing press. When you take flexo printing, you learn how to run the flexo press. When you take our pre-press classes, you learn how to impose pages and build forms and make plates and prepare artwork for printing. Everything we teach is hands-on. So my favorite thing about the graphic communication department is that the faculty is so diverse, they have experience in the industry, and I think that translates for students into um, an entrepreneurial mindset. It really provides an opportunity for students to have instructors that have really walked the talk. My favorite thing about graphic communication really stems from uh, the print side of it. Uh, I've been part of this department for well over 30 years now from a student and now teaching in it. Uh, I love all the hardware, I love the, the visual aspect of print, the picking up of the piece of paper and understanding how the paper was made and how the print on it uh, uh, conveys that information. My favorite thing about graphic communication is its constant evolution. From where I started in this industry to where it is today is, is a big change. And I always like learning new things, and um, in this field you will always be learning new things. My favorite thing about GRC are the professors. They've all added a lot of meaning to my career here at Cal Poly. We're very unique uh, in that we offer three specific graphic communication career days per year. Um, and we get anywhere from 20, I think at one point we've had as close to 29 companies come in to the department. We have people like Apple Computer, we have Facebook, we have uh, the R.R. Donnelly Company, the world's largest printer. We have Quad Graphics, the world's second largest printer. We have many companies who come to meet our students and to hire them to pick up students for summer internships and to develop their relationships with Cal Poly students because it's the future of the industry. It's led to me getting a job after graduation um, from talking to some people there. I've made some great connections. Um, it really just is a comfortable place and even if you aren't ready to get a job yet, um, it's just a great opportunity to go kind of practice networking, socializing, people that are always really nice. We also have an in-house, student-run, student-managed graphic communication enterprise called University Graphic Systems. Uh, we have 10 managers in there who dedicate one year of their life to running this, this business, and uh, it's all up to them to make the decisions. University Graphic Systems is our department's specific entrepreneurial, experiential program for students to learn and run a real business um, in the graphic communication industry. So it's a um, a marketing services, a printing services, a design services a company. It's not strictly print. Um, I would just say it's a marketing communications type of experience. So I'm the uh, general manager at University Graphic Systems here in the GRC department. 
UGS, uh, for short, is a 100% student-run print company. From the start, uh, I get to hire my team, uh, decide on the budget, um, do all kinds of human resource work and, and production management. And obviously it's benefited me greatly. It, it, it's what led to me getting a, securing a job after graduation. It kind of it formed what I wanted to do after graduation and made that like a sure thing for me. I'm the advisor to the Shakespeare Press Museum. I have a long history with Shakespeare Press Museum. I was the second student curator in 1970 for the Shakespeare Press Museum, so to me, this is home. I love the fact that we have a museum, both as a classroom and as a place where students can learn about 19th and early 20th century printing processes, but it, it's, a, it's a place that is uh, both a museum and an opportunity for students to learn about technologies that many people are think are passe. I'm the head student curator here at the Shakespeare Press Museum. Some of my jobs are showing people who come in how to letterpress, the whole process of letterpress, and training other student curators, uh, making sure we have all the supplies needed for the museum, and making sure that we're making workshops that invite other people outside of our department to get involved in the museum. I would suggest coming in with an open mind and ready to learn a lot of new things and expose yourself to areas that you were maybe not familiar with before or even if you don't think you would like that, I think students can be surprised by how much they enjoy doing something when they didn't expect that. Okay, so even though we ask students to choose a concentration, my advice is to really branch out and work on a diverse skill set. If you just want to be a graphic designer, um, it's still so important to know like how that design is eventually going to be applied, um, whether it be through print or through web or digital media or something. What's interesting about this major is it's, it's really whatever you want it to be. A lot of students come in and they're creative, yet they like the technical aspects, and yet they want to be part of the, the business acumen. And so after taking two to three years, you choose your concentrations, you fall in love inevitably with potentially research that a professor is doing, and you walk out of here four years and you're prepared to go into the industry. Graphic communication is one of the widest fields available for students today. Uh, to enable themselves to go into virtually every different type of business that's available. Ask yourself if you're interested in design and production or if you're interested in um, website design, user experience, user interface. Those are areas where we are specialists and when it comes to developing communications, mass communications in any form, we will teach you how to do that. We're really excited to welcome you into our department. We look forward to having you in our classes. We're really excited to have you join our graphic communication family. Since I teach the introductory class, GRC 101, I'll see you in class the first week of class and I will see you from that moment on. I can't wait to have you on campus. I can't wait for you to meet everybody here. I can't wait for you to meet the students and hear some of the successes that they've had. And more importantly, I can't wait to, to, to welcome you into our GRC family.